Ryan Chari, the 28-year-old. Uh, Bowled him straight through. Extra set from Shaheen Sharafridi. And Chari's gone. Deadly with the new ball. Ball darting back into the right-hander. And as so often, with the new ball, he attacks the stumps. The angle of the left arm is so difficult when the ball swinging back in. But when he makes it, that it hits the middle stump, you've got no chance whatsoever. Shine Shafridi strikes with the new ball. Shari out for two. It's two for one. Oh, yes. The death rattle again from Shaheen. That's the way you do it. You don't clip the bales. You hit the stump. The inside edge right onto the middle stump. And Shine Shafridi with yet another ball. This time, a little bit of help from the batsman, a big inside edge. Uh, played on or clean ball, doesn't matter. Still, wickets with the new ball for Shaheen Shah Freedy. Gone for 13. If he's getting the ball to tweak, and done. So, partnership has been broken. Imad Basim, you can bet your bottom dollar that he'll bail you out of a tough situation. Harris Rao took the catch. Carrying on as long as they can in the Zimbabwean innings. Craig Irvin, it's a shot that he plays well. And uh, quite often gets that either over that man or past them to the boundary for four. However, it wasn't to be this time. Ah, uh, good delivery. Fabulous delivery. It's the Jaffa. Really was quick. And a wonderful delivery to get rid of the left-hander. And it had a telling effect on the batsman, just drawing away from the line of the ball. And nicely held by the keeper. Deep and wicket on the boundary. Balled him, knocked him over. Madaveri looking leg side, and it was straight and full from Wahab Riaz. And that's the end of a wonderful little innings from the youngster Wesley Madaveri. Yeah, the pressure just got a little too much for uh, the young man. Looked to force the ball before. Couldn't get it away. Looked to force that one. And Wahab Riaz, you miss, I hit. It's been a really, really good knock. Brendan Taylor, he's looked to go up and over the man who's in the circle at mid-off. It's gone straight up and taken by Wahab Riaz. The spirit of cricket is alive here in Ralpindi. This has gone a mile high. And Wahab, that's one he didn't want to drop. A brilliant innings from Brendan Taylor. Off stump goes, Raza perishes. Wahab Riaz is deadly at the death and he is so difficult to get away. Being the man who can come back for Pakistan at the back end of the innings and take wickets. And that's exactly what he's doing. And that's his third. Mohab Riaz and uh, Sikandar Raza perishes. He gets eight. Tries to loft him over mid-off. And he finds Wahab Riaz yet again. Well, you can't keep Wahab away from the wickets. If he's not bowling the Zimbabwean batsman out, he's catching them at mid-off. Well judged in the end by uh, Wahab Riaz. Sees the end of Karl Mumba just for the one. Bullseye! A fifth wicket for Shaheen Sharafridi. He is unerringly accurate with that Yorker. He's one of the best in the business. Back-to-back five-wicket hauls for this tall, talented left-arm quick from Pakistan. That's yeah, been uh, a wonderful performance of the ball from Shaheen. And that is a wonderful Yorker. Crashed into your stump before Chisora could even think of getting his back down in time. Gives thanks to almighty Allah for yet another five-wicket haul. Zimbabwe's ninth ball. Tendai Chisoro goes for five. Like that. Wahab Riaz finishes things off with his fourth wicket. And Zimbabwe are balled out with two balls to go. Zimbabwe, 255 all out. This is the end. Muzalabani 
making room and Rahab Riaz has done that to more illustrious players along the way. Nine wickets right there and Imad Wasim another left armer with the 10th. 